guys and welcome to Cooper Motorcycles. Today we want to talk to you about our 865cc Big Bore Twin. This interceptor has got the SNS 865 kit on it um, and the kit comprises of the cylinders and high compression pistons and it also comes with a new head gasket. Uh, but then we also sell the SNS high lift camshaft um, and to complete your kit we uh, replace the uh, stretch bolts. We've got these in stock. These are the genuine Royal Enfield stretch bolts and we keep the base gasket as well. So we can supply all of that for you. In addition, well, with this one, what we've done is we've got a handmade, much bigger diameter exhaust on it. Um, and we've got the uh, SNS free flow air filter and the door delete kit. We've also fitted a Dynajet power commander. And we've had the bike set up on a rolling road locally at a dyno shop and we're really pleased with the results. See, at the rear wheel, the horsepower is now 61 horsepower. A stock bike would have just over 40. And the peak torque is 83 newton meters, whereas a standard one would be just under 50. So there's a huge amount of difference. The, most of the torque has come from the bore kit and the diameter of the engine. And what that does, when you ride the bike, it feels like it's maintained its natural character. Uh, it's got a nice broad spread of power between three and a half, four thousand RPM, which is really where you spend most of the time riding the bike. And then if you want to crack on after that, it's really, really nice. It's smooth, it's powerful. It feels a bit like a stock one, just a lot growlier with a lot more go. We're really satisfied with the results. And if we wanted to, there is more power to come. Uh, we've actually ridden the lock stock bike from uh, the Sinroja brothers. And that has had the head ported, it's running a kit ECU with dual injectors. Um, and they can get sort of 90 horsepower on petrol uh, and 100 horsepower on race fuel. But really, we just wanted the, the broader spread of torque with more power, and we think what we've done so far has achieved that. So, regarding cost, the kit itself uh, starts at just over a thousand pounds. But if you want to talk about the bike being done from start to finish, there's so many variants really. It depends on the exhaust you want and what other bits and bobs you want to have to go with it. You need to have the uprated clutch. And really, to wheel a standard bike in here and to wheel it out with the 865 kit on, all done and dusted, including the machining costs and the labor to do the work, you can spend anywhere between three and 4,000 pounds, depending on the type of exhaust that you have. Uh, so it's a huge amount of money, and it's obviously not for everybody, but we're really pleased we've done it. This bike is for ourselves, for our own personal enjoyment. And we're already thinking about doing another one in a slightly different way. So, yeah, we like it. We'd do it again. If you want us to do it for you, give us a call. Thanks.